Hello dear friends, welcome to my channel. Today's discussion is the problem of the shortest distance. Find the shortest distance between the point 1,0 and ellipse 4x square plus 9y square is equal to 36. Solution. We have to find the shortest distance P1, 1,0 and Px2, y2 where P2, x2, y2 lies on the ellipse 4x square plus 9y square equals to 36. The arc length P1, P2 of the minimizing curve y is equal to yx is given by this is the ellipse, this is the x and y axis and this is the P1, 1,0 and P2, x2, y2. So I hope I can clear length, I have to find out the arc length means p1 and p2 minimizing curve y is equal to yx okay and this curve is this this curve equation is 4x square plus 9y square is equal to 36 and this is the center okay this is the equation of the ellipse i hope you can understand all the diagram and all and the questions now i have to solve it through the variation of variations this is the problem of the variation and the point is O. Now i y x is equal to 1 plus x2 into 1 plus y dash whole square into to the power half because path of the of the ellipse. This is the formula. Okay. So where the end point P1 equal to 1 comma 0 is fixed and while the and p2 x2 comma y2 lies on equation i and f is equal to 1 plus y dash whole square to the power and 1 plus y dash whole square the whole square okay this is the f so since f is independent of x and y because you have already learned in my you have learned in my channel that is the uh, calculus of variations okay you have learned, I think you have learned calculus of variation in my channel. So you can understand this kind of problem. So it is this kind of problem is called Bra Chista Chrome problem. Bra Chista Chrome, please, please, uh, I will give the link in here. You will must watch Bra Chista Chrome generalizations of Bra Chista Chrome problem. Okay, this is very, very important for for learning this kind of problem because Bra Chista Chrome problem is same type like uh, you have to find out shortest distance. Okay, so if is independent of x and y and Euler's equation extended form reduces to y double dash del f del square f divided by del y dash and y double dash is equal to 0 del square f is equal to del y dash whole square it does not equal to 0 and y is equal to c1x plus c2 and which is a straight line along the required shortest distance is attained okay i hope friends it is clear and equation 3 must pass p1 comma 0 and when p1 comma 0 passes through this point so c1 plus c2 is equal to 0 and c1 equals to minus c2 so yx is equal to c1 into x minus 1 and also it must passes through x2 comma y2 and y2 is equal to c1 x2 minus 1 
and now y is equal to 2 into root over 9 minus x square divided by 3 psi x and now by using transversality condition for psi x we get f plus psi dash minus y dash f y dash x equals to x2 equals to 0. And we get root over 1 plus y dash whole square plus 2 by 3 into half into this because psi dash is equal to is equal to 2x divided by root over 9 a 9 minus x square. Okay. And y f f y is equal to y dash 2y dash plus root of, divided by root over 1 plus y dash whole square. And this is the simple derivative. And take y dash is equal to c1, and after calculation, I get this value. And I get 1 minus 2x2 c1 and 9 minus x2 whole square. And I get this value. This is the this value I get number equation number 4. And 4x2 x2 square minus plus 9 y2 square is equal to 36 because this is the equation of the ellipse. And from equation 7 and 6, we have. 4x2 square plus 9c1 square plus x2 minus 1 whole square is equal to 36 and 4 into 9 minus x2 square this is the values and 6 and 8 we get this value x2 minus x1 and we get a relationship and we get 5x2 equal to 9 and x2 equal to 9 by 5 and if I put the value x2, then we get the value of the c1, c1 equal to 2 after the calculation, okay. And c2 value y2 equal to 2 into 9 by 5 minus 1 equals to 8 by 5. Yeah, this is the y2 value because the by the equation. Which equation? This this equation you get you get get that c into x minus 1 okay c1 into x minus 1 is the y2 y2 equation i am just putting the value of the c1 and value of the x so i get 8 by 5 and required shortest distance is equal to 9 by 5 minus 1 whole square and 8 by 5 minus 0 whole square and i get this is the 4 by root over 5 by 5 thanks for watching i hope it is clear for everyone